Hello and welcome back to Let's Play on Shogun 2 with the Shimazu on Legendary Difficulty. I know this is not the Takeda. Normally I do, well, so far I've been doing one episode every other day um, together with the Takeda campaign. But I really enjoyed this campaign yesterday, especially after my uh, economics rant. Um, so I figured, fuck it, I'm just going to do another Shogun 2, or another uh, Shimazu uh, episode right now as well, the day after. Um, this one's actually currently the more popular one as well, but that actually has no reason, or has nothing to do with it. I just wanted to play more of this one because I was enjoying it so much. Is a man not allowed to choose what video or what campaign he wants to play on a specific particular day? Uh, anyway, so yes, uh, last time we had started recruiting our bow warrior monks, which is fantastic, which means you already also recruited one cavalry, so I need to recruit three more. And then that will be the third army's. Archer's done, One, these ones are done, and then I just need a bunch of infantry, which I believe those are done next turn. So actually, our next, our third army is going to be done in two turns. Holy shit, we have to obviously move it together, but even so. This guy was going to go in here. You are my commissioner for warfare, right? The crappy duke, we don't give a shit about him. And this guy is my commissioner for supply. Where was my son? And Was he leading this army here he was wasn't he yes okay so our next army is going to be led by the commissioner for development here which means i should have sent him down but that's okay we'll just send the entire army by navy which means i need to prepare another navy again where's my big navy my big navy um okay so i'm wondering how we're going to make this happen because obviously the biggest compartment's coming from here but they get an extra turn of movement because of course these ones are only done later so i think we're just going to try and converge on bungo so, uh, I could pick them up here, but I think I'll, probably just running them would be faster. I could even load them on the boats here, that might be even better. Uh, either way, we'll, we'll start sending them down this way. Uh, and then, yeah, we'll just run this stuff, probably put them on the boat here, and then sail over there, get the calf, get the infant, uh, archers as well. You're gonna go grab Nagato, which should be under. Well, there's a, yeah, rebel army, but that should be fine. This is our definitely better second army. And a level up for our summon air, which is good. Oh, and there's our first uh, lag spike of the day. Every time I uh, record a new... Like, well, I, I only record one episode a day, usually, to, uh, these days. Holy fuck. Um, and yeah, it, it looks like whenever I start up the game for the first time again, um, it, it has this problem where it lags on the first uh, autosave of the game. Which is really weird. But there you go. Um, so people have suggested, and I've, I've talked about this a couple times, just to... Um, it's a rice exchange, that's annoying. I am half tempted to remove this and then rebuild it to a regular market. Anyway, yeah, to uh, to re uh, reset my mods, which is probably the right way to go. But uh, I think you're just going to stick around here. Because I need to um, make sure we, we keep... Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm going to keep it. Fuck it, it's too much trouble. Uh, ooh, that actually reduced us to minus one food. Because of the fortress as well as the rice exchange. Okay, so maybe I should remove it. Because... Well, we're going to take Sanuki. Not this turn, because I'm assuming the army is still in there. It's not! Well, never mind. I just abandoned it. Should I offer them? What was it? 12 grand for peace now? Or do you, Well, they offer me 12 grand. Did I actually... Oh, that's annoying. I need to upgrade this too. Right, then we're predicted zero, but I think we're going to be below one before we get to zero. So I'm actually going to have to cancel this rice exchange and then just rebuild it. Uh, anyway, yeah, so, yeah, re reinstall the mods. I still need to do that, but I'm kind of thinking I'll do it after I've completed these campaigns, because, um, I, like I said, I've been, I'm planning on doing actual modded campaigns after these as well. Uh, like, actual, you know, master strategy or something along those lines, because I know people have been asking for that for fucking ages. Um, right, Tosa's unhappy, and we can make it happy... No, we can't. I really thought I had an... I thought I, I thought I mapped it out. Wait, no, I can't. Yes, we're going to gain one from this, one from that, and then I need to recruit two units. Yes, I remember now. I remember now. Cool. Uh, so that place is going to be fine. You are happy now, so I can remove this unit in Sanuki. We are obviously not happy, but we have an army there. I can't reach Awa instantly, so I'm not going to bother. Although, I am half tempted to move up to the border... Anyway, because this army might otherwise run that way, and I'll be further away. Actually, well, I'd be able to reach them, actually. But I think it's still probably worth it. 
I'm gonna put him in an ambush though. Alright, so. Oh! This could be interesting actually. They'll probably turn around out of my armies here because they're like, oh, Sanuki's empty, let's go grab it. Um, but yeah, there, there's a chance that they're gonna go. I've seen this before, they're gonna take their army and run all the way to Tosa through the forest. Like, this is all forest here. Which means it takes them like six turns to get there. In the meantime, I could take those two towns and their army just disappears if they're in my territory. So yeah, if they do that, great. If they don't, also great. I want to kind of fight that battle. Um, I was, of course, also, after these four are done, I'm just going to recruit four more Naganata warrior monks to replace those crappy Naganata, or uh, Yari samurai. Uh, oh, one more thing I forgot to mention. When I was talking about money last time, I was talking about upgrading these buildings and such. Um, and uh, one thing I forgot to mention, of course, is that while I do lose growth everywhere, because of course the food thing, I, I don't want to go into a full rant again, although people seem, most people seem to appreciate it. Um, while I, of course, I lose, I lose growth in every single province, I actually gain more growth in the towns where I have uh, the Metscape, because every time you upgrade the market, you get more growth. So obviously this, this uh, level, uh, the Merchant Guild has 20, but... Uh, so I guess, yeah, we'll start with the market. The market gives you five, but, you know, every town looks going to have a regular market. But you upgrade it to a rice exchange, you get another five. So, for ten. And then you get twenty. And twenty growth per turn in a town where you have, let's say, 50% tax rate, because it's easy math. Every turn, you make an extra ten koku from this one town. Every turn. And, of course, I'm losing in every other province slowly as well. But that makes up for that by itself already plus again you make you know an extra 275 or whatever i said every turn from just having this building itself of course you have to upgrade the building too there's there's a cost associated with the building itself so you have to also take that into calculation which i to be fair didn't but even so i still think it's definitely worth it um the person who i was specifically referring to hasn't responded yet though so let's see what he says uh, anyway we got our first bow warrior monks i think i'm just gonna remove a bunch of stuff here Reduce our cost a little bit. We don't need these guys here anymore because we have another army there. Um, let's just get rid of a couple more. Get our income back up again. Uh, okay, so yeah. Interesting shit's about to happen with all this stuff. So much recruitment. Now, navy stuff. I feel like I'm forgetting maybe something. Nope. I just have these four extra ships here that are seem kind of random. I think I might mail an extra two and have another slightly larger navy roaming around. Um, so yeah, we're doing that. Tosa was going to be fine. Sanuki, I didn't even think about this or uh, consider this yet. So we're going to gain one, two, and five. So we're going to be, okay, this place is going to be happy next turn already. And then after that, we get the culture stuff of the socket. And yeah, this place is completely fine. All right. Um, good. We can try the Satomi for some reason. I'm honored to receive you. It is you? always a good you got a single day time. when friends come vessel. to talk. Well, I would have totally done that for the extra, the extra um, honor I would have gotten from that. We say yes to seven k. I think he said yes to six k, didn't he? Will you do sixty five? Yeah, I'll take that. We're getting awful close to that. Well, actually, no, we're not. Well, we're making seven grand a turn now, so we're getting close to that 90k again, or 100k again. I just want to pass it. It's kind of funny that we set that goal for ourselves more as, as a joke, and now it's actually becoming this thing, like, can I reach that 100k mark? Uh, right, was there anything else I needed to do? I don't believe it to be true. What I do need to check, actually, is if I've got any new richer towns. Uh, yes, Tosa outriches uh, Satsuma. It's not getting any richer, though, so I don't know if it's... Well, actually, no, it is, because it's getting the farm. Yeah, I guess I could send someone over here, but I'll probably have to send them into Iwami soon anyway, so... I think what I might do is actually send this um, Metsuke with the navy. Oh, right, that's what I need to do, is pick up... No, I already had that planned. Uh, yeah, put him on, on the ship as well. And have him go to Iwami, or I could run him, because honestly it wouldn't even take that long. Uh, but yeah, either way, I need to get someone to Iwami, because that's going to certainly overtake Satsuma. And then Tosa will certainly be poorer than that. Bungo needs to get replaced at some point as well, or at least the Metsuke in Bungo needs to go elsewhere at some point. He's going to level up as well though, that's nice. Um, but I don't know if we're going to take any other richer towns until we get to like Omi or Owari, which that's a decent time away from now still. 
acquired our superior stone again. None of that disgusting, horrible stone. Um, I also, I also sh should definitely not have talked about the fact that people don't watch fully videos and then ask questions. Because I'm pretty sure a ton of people were joking, but they commented really obvious stuff. And I'm like, oh god, I don't know if these people are joking or not. Like, some people are like, so why, why are you recruiting Yari Samurai again? I'm like, I don't know if this is a joke. Because I've talked about this many times, but I don't know if you're doing that on purpose because I specifically said that people ask stupid questions. And then someone else mentioned, oh, you should use those Shimazu Heavy Gunners. And I was like, ah, I talked about this. I don't know if you're joking or not. Are you an idiot or are you just funny? What's going on? Um, so yeah, there you go. Anyway, and that's her. So yeah, um... Ooh, they're trying. But they failed. I don't even- I actually think the black ship may have actually fleed. Fleed? Fled? It's- it- I mean- Oh! Well. They ran into the ambush. Uh, I don't think it's worth fighting now. Goodbye. Go on, step back on your territory. I want replenishment. <laughs> it's a fucking teleport. The uh, the thing is, though, they may have moved their full army first, which would be kind of funny. But I don't know if we're going to be able to make them uh, disappear. I would. I could really use a ninja over there. Armed with the dead. Armed um, with the deadly. Okay, so that's this guy over here. And a monk as well. And a mountain arrest as well. Alright. Uh, you, my man, you make me some extra cash. How about that? Unfortunately, no extra good traits, so I'll just take the lower chance of being murderized. So, exempt this place. So, we're making 6 grand and 28. No, 62, 28. That's one of our weaker towns as well. If you put him in a really expensive or rich town. It's going to be great. Another clan has died. This is the Imagawa. It was the Imagawa. Right, so here we want to recruit four Naganata warrior monks. I can also recruit another Monkeruni, you know? Monkeruni? Something like that. Man, we have so many agents stuffed in these territories. It's ridiculous. I sure, certainly, I certainly should get my ninjas um, over there now. Oh, you son of a bitch. Get the fuck out of my way. Alright, let's uh, pop a couple ninjas on this ship here. Off you go! You as well. Uh, you know what, I'll send the Mets... No, I was Yeah! I was gonna send him from here. It's not a huge difference, but... Um... Yeah, alright, I'll do this. I'll, uh, I'll send this Metsuke man. This is going to lose me a little bit of money for a little bit, but that's okay. They're going to go in there. And then Metsuke Man is going to run to Bungo. And this navy is going to go there. You guys are all going to just head over there. Metsuke, or the Sake Den, Market, Buddhist Temple, Farm Upgrade. Alright, now we're talking. Cool. Uh, so that is that. Um, I still need more agents to go that way, but for the moment it's all Gucci. I think I might want to keep one of them probably back home forever, so I'm just going to pump, put him into... Yeah, I'll keep him boozing for now, but yeah. I should send one of them into Bungo, or I guess this guy can stay behind. Um, to deal with naval invasions that will inevitably come at some point. Just having a ninja on the island of Gucci will certainly help. All the way to the late game. Uh, right, so these nine broskis and a general, but the general is going to be that guy leading them, but I could still send someone with just to speed things along. So I guess that'll be this guy because he hasn't moved yet. This guy would make it cheaper, but we don't need the money. Um, can you get here right now? Not quite, but it probably would still be faster than trying to get them on the ship here. So let's um, just move over here and then we'll pop Tono. These guys, was it him? Yeah, it was him. Uh, just over here. Oh, I should go to the town. Doesn't matter, I can't get in there anyway. Uh, if I wasn't in a hurry, I could have just sent this guy, because it would be ch cheaper to do so. But now, it's a little bit too late. Then... Uh, words... 
I guess. Right, so this situation here, right, Sanuki, first of all. It wasn't actually fine yet, but it will be fine next turn, so that's cool. So the thing is, this army that was an Awa, well, it could actually be there, I, I don't know, but it, it, there's a chance it moved this way, and then they ran into the ambush. So, if I could take both these towns right now, then I could... Well, actually, no, they wouldn't even disappear, because they're still in their own territory. Like, they, they would have to keep moving this way to go to Tosa, and then try and capture Tosa. But that's not gonna happen. So, okay, they're back in the town already anyway, so it's all completely fucking irrelevant what I just talked about. Now, these two guys, do I kill them all first? I feel like if I do that, I won't be able to reach Awa anymore. So I think we're just gonna go for Awa and see what happens. Hello! I'm, uh, I'm just gonna siege them out. I'm not in a rush here. Winter attrition next turn, but they're gonna take attrition every turn. Uh, if they attack this, they won't be able to take it with those two units, so that's fine. We constructed a... That's why we have another monk, right? How many monks... Do we have five yet? I think we do. One, two... Three, four. No, we're still missing one, but I'm building another Mets or, um, Buddhist temple here, so we will be able to get another one soon. In fact, if I wait until I take Aki, I think Aki has the... Um, yeah, I could recruit level three monks. Monks. Plural. Um... Okay. Oh, this guy leveled up. Right, yes. That's... I knew I forgot something. I knew it. A cat. That's great. Oh, I would be converted faster as well. If there was a cat. Although, if it was a dog, it'd be plus two, to be fair. Because dogs are clearly superior. Let's start a discussion about that in the comments, eh? I do like cats. I'm an animal person in general. But, um... Dogs are clearly superior. There's no question. Don't even bother arguing in the comments, actually. Because you're wrong. Um... Right, the question now is, do we f go to war with the Matsuda right now? I think we're going to wait, because obviously my next army is arriving in like two turns. Well, maybe a little bit longer because movement, but yeah, three turns or something. And then I think we'll just start expanding as fast as, ramp as, fast as we possibly want to. And then we can bring this army over from Shikoku as well. I need to get a navy at some point. I... well, I can just build one ship in Awaji, I guess that's fine. I was going to say, I do, I do need some ships here. I guess that would be your job. You can just come over here instead. I've got these two ships from here done next turn as well, and then they can join in. And we'll gather up around Awaji so I can just plop this army somewhere on the shore around here if I want to. Oh my fucking god, look at the Iko Iki. Why, dude? We finally have no fucking religion to deal with here, because we started over here, and now half the world is owned by the goddamn Iko Iki. <laughs> Holy shit, they are doing really well. They definitely have the most towns in the campaign right now. Terrifying. The, oh, 17 fucking... Re they've almost triggered Ron to fight themselves. I know they can't, but Jesus Christ. Um, who is next? I think mean, the Jimbo. Own, oh, they only had two. Sorry. Hojo, was it? Yeah, Hojo on 11 as well. So I think we are the second... Actually, the Matsuda? Matsuda's 12 as well. So yeah, we're second together with the Matsuda. The Satomi might die very quickly. I'd love to pick up a random vassal. Just... Uh, Get an extra honor, and then have that person die immediately afterwards. Ah, Tano, we're down to a single town too, are they? I will hear like, sometimes if they're besieged or something by someone else, they'll just take the uh, becoming a vassal because they think it'll save them. And then you just laugh in their fucking faces as they die, and you gain plus one honor from their death. Uh -huh. uh, anyway, on to uh, greener pastures. Uh, this is the shittiest fucking... The five elements, fuck off. So shit. Why am I going for these goddamn Shumazu over gunners? I need to. I'm probably gonna get rid of the Saka then soon in that town just so I can start building those buildings. I know I'm not anywhere near there yet, but I wanna. You know, I might forget in the future. Oh, they got some reinforcements coming in. They uh, let me siege them though. They did not sally out, which means that I probably will start taking attrition. Well, I will take a turn of attrition next turn if they don't siege, or if they don't sally out yet. Oh my god, the black ship's gonna fucking complete the circle. It's almost halfway there. Another Metsuke ranked up. Ooh. Mission issued. Recruit a ranged infantry. We got keen... Are you fucking joking? We just completed doing that. We're, we, that that's, we're done. You dickhead. What the hell? Uh, okay, what I'll do is I'll recruit one of these guys. Holy shit, they have four experience. Um, balance of strength, because I haven't got enough archers. 
I shall never. The versity on the battlefield is key to victory. Every weapon has its purpose, and every unit has its match. It has come to my attention that our forces are unbalanced, my lord. We are currently deploying comparatively few foot archers. The role that these troops play in softening the enemy before they can be dealt with in close combat is a vital one indeed. How better to thin the numbers and break the spirits of an incoming fighting force than with a volley of deadly arrow fire. I strongly recommend that we train more archers at the first available opportunity. I only have two turns to do this as well, but I gain, I gain plus two experience for six turns. So yeah, we recruit one of these, and then I'll just recruit the next army's bow warrior monks, I guess. Uh, Sanuki, yeah, okay, that's cool. Right, I'm gonna remove this building here now. I'm also going to plop Tono. That's a new one. Plop Tono. Uh, you guys on the ship, and sail you over there. Then the cavalry. Do I need... No, I don't need you to run them. You're gonna go over here. Then the archers are also gonna run down here. And then we're all gonna get on those ships and we're gonna meet up next turn. And then we're gonna land here and take Suo basically the turn after. So yeah, looks like actually in two turns. I could probably do it this like coming turn if I like split up ships and stuff and I just remove my ships. Um, but yeah, either way, next turn, or two turns from now, sorry, we'll be able to, uh, m start murdering the Matsuda dickheads. I think we're just gonna remove this. I was gonna use these support of Mashaka Shigaru, and then I never actually put them into an army. They're just not, w they're so crap, but I did say I was gonna use them. It just feels, ugh, whatever, I'm gonna keep him for now. Oh, fuck, this guy's supposed to lead the army. Oops, <laughs> send him with as well. Before I forget. Um... And then actually, I shouldn't have brought this guy onto the army, onto the navy. I should have kept him off, but I can drop him off, I guess, at some point. It's gonna be slightly awkward, but oh well. Um, right, those four units, they, those are all Ashigaru. If they attack Sanuki, would not be great. I'll recruit one Yara Ashigaru just in case. I think would probably be okay, but still. Um, we have two spare happiness here, so we'll send those over there, and actually, in that case, no point recruiting one. Let's put those two in there. Save myself some money. Then, do we have any trade or anything like that? Nope. We're at War to Miyoshi, but that's not gonna change. Uh, agents, right, yes. I'm gonna pop Tono you guys in here. And you. This guy's not supposed to be here, he's supposed to be in here, but obviously don't own the town yet, so... This guy as well, and I believe I had a Metsuke rank up, so that's the final one to get to level five, 4, even. But those are the biggest level ups, level 4, so you get plus 3 overseeing towns. And possibly another one? Not this time. Uh, take the lower chance of being murderized, and then now we're at 5-8. Man, we went from 4-9 to 5-8, holy shit. There, there's, there was, I was also the other guy going in here, of course. It was 2 Metsuke. Um, right. I was gonna send you two with these four, but I'm not gonna bother anymore. Oh fuck, what I need as well. I need some ships here to run these next four. I got some warrior monks over. Fucking son of a bitch, I keep forgetting about everything. Um, okay, I'll probably just send them because they're not gonna get here in time for this war anyway. So I'll just, I don't need to be in a rush. I can just send, I can just run them this way. They can run together with this guy here. Um, I will ferry you back here as well. You could be my next uh, pickup point man. This monk is going to sit in here for no real reason. I'm pretty sure we, at this point, Christianity is basically almost gone. 21% left. Okay. Um, there's something else. What was it? I certainly am forgetting something, but... By God, if I figure out what it is. Oh my god, I'll be able to recruit much like Kaboya on Siege Tower Bude. Oh, how very exciting, am I right, guys? <clears throat> my voice. It is dying. Uh, yes, right, my next army. That's what I was forgetting. Well, uh, yeah, I guess I'm, I'm waiting for... No, yeah, there's no reason to do it right now. I'll start recruiting the fourth army next turn. Because we're waiting for that one archer to give me the archer buffs. Shyla buffs. Uh, just in case people are wondering and are going to comment about it. The reason I'm not recruiting the next two already as well... Well, multiple reasons. For one, I only need six of them, and I can record uh, recruit them in batches of three. So recruiting two of them is kind of pointless because then I need to. I still need to four more turns to recruit the remaining four. Um, but also queuing these guys up now, 
I, they're not going to get the buff that I'm that this unit's going to give up on the mission that's going to complete. Like units that are already recruited don't gain any buffs. It's similar to I think it was this campaign. It might have been the Takeda one, where I was recruiting cavalry. I think it was the Takeda one actually. I was recruiting cavalry um, with their buffs of um, extra charge bonus or whatever. And then a ninja came in on the turn that there was one turn remaining on the units, and it uh, destroyed the, it sabotaged the building that gave me the buff. But the units that were already recruited still gained the buff because they were already in the queue before that happened. So similar to here, there's no point recruiting these two guys right now because they're not going to gain the buff of extra plus two experience that this guy's going to get from completing the mission. If you know what I mean. Uh, anyway, let's end the turn. Pretty sure there's something else I forgot. It might have been those four ships right there. Not really in a rush though, so... Oh, you know what? I could have sent them four back to go pick up the four warrior monks, but oh well. Miyoshi, you dickhead. Oh my god, that cost me like four grand. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. I'm gonna gain a bow samurai this coming turn as well, by the way, from that mission being completed. Obviously, he's getting going straight in the trash. In the T-Rash. Oh, there goes the black ship. I'm, I'm rooting for him to make to complete the circle. Be sick. Income is below a thousand bucks now because there's stupid blockading here. Trade gains, plus one loyalty. Alright. Winter attrition, right. No, we knew it was coming. Painful, but they're taking small amounts of attrition as well during this sieging. Uh, right, you need to be removed from the face of the earth, uh, as do you. Whoa, look at that fucking boat. Porshigara, not bad. I'm gonna recruit three of you. For one of you. For one of you. Uh, and then this is just gonna be the next army, so yeah, more katana, samurai. And you're gonna remove this ship so our income doesn't die. Cool, I'll take him. Alright, cool. Uh, Buddhist temple, so I can get another monk out. Uh, should I wait until we take Aki? That probably does seem prudent. Right, okay, here we go. So, you're gonna sail over here. Then... Oh, God, this is confusing. Because I need to take off just him. But I think we're just gonna have to do it later or something. Actually, hold on, if we do this, then... Send, actually, all of them and then him back. Okay, that works. Yeah, now the big army, or big navy, has the full army. And this one guy is on here and he can be dropped off again. Perfect! Go home, you're drunk. Fuck me, you can run for ages. Alright, you're going in here. Uh, and this guy is gonna bring these four somewhere. I think we're just gonna run this way. And we're gonna do the same, we're just drop them off some, uh, on some uh, ships there. And hey there, Rover, send them over. Uh, you're gonna sit in there, you're gonna keep sieging that out. You can probably remove more units, but we'll just do that next turn. You four ships are going to join these two. And then that's gonna go east with the four Nanganata warrior monks. The rest is all fine. You're repairing. I might send one ship up this way instead, but that doesn't really matter. You're still chillaxing, relaxing, all cool. Shouldn't some beatball outside of the school. Uh, so yeah, you're gonna drop off there and then we're gonna take Suo. Possibly next turn. They actually seem to be recruiting an army there. Which is slightly inconvenient, but it's okay. Okay. Then. We got nothing here. Anyone want to be my vassal yet? If you want to be my I vassal. Unacceptable. Alright. Uh, what else do we have? I feel like there's once again certainly something I'm forgetting, but... God knows. Do I have anything exempted? I don't right now. Just make sure I haven't been fucking up this whole time. Ha ha. Ha ha. Um, yes, I guess more agents. I, I do need to send more agents over. Also, I need to build this. Yeah, I totally forgot to do that. Doesn't matter. Plenty of time. That's why I wanted to do it in advance so I don't forget shitty stupid things like that. 
this ninja man is going to do stuff here, but I think I'm just going to send him over for now. As well as his other ninja friends. And then this monk, perhaps? I mean, this place actually might need... No, it's very happy. I do think sending monks up is the right way to go, but... I don't know. For now, just have three monks in there, why not? This ninja's gonna stay back. And another than that, it's just Metsuke here. Okay, so that's all sorted. Haha! -ha. I also don't know when I'm gonna stop recruiting armies, because I'm obviously... We're starting the fourth army now. Slowly but surely. Which, by the way, if I was being really smart about it, I can only recruit four units a turn here, so I really ought to wait with recruiting the cavalry and such. This is six turns, right? So we're totally fine on that, yeah. Um, yeah, because basically I, I need four... Well, if I was being really smart about this, I would only recruit one of these right now. So I recruit one, then four, then four, that's nine, and then the four calves, six archers. So yeah, this is the smartest way of doing it. It costs me the least. If I was being really smart about it, no, this is the smartest I can be about it, I think. Uh, okay, can you... They're probably going to sally out now, because it's two turns remaining. We have probably got loads of things to do that I'm forgetting, but let's end the turn anyway. And that ruddy turn... They probably will sally out, but they don't have to necessarily. They could wait another turn, but the AI usually does sally out. There you go. Cool. Four Yari Shigaru in the reinforcement army. Oh, how cute. You got some light calf. I have some Yari calf. What do you say to that? Uh, Alright, cool. It's a pretty straightforward army. Four generals again. Daimyo, Sun and Air, and two randos. Very cool. Oh, you got some improved charge. How very exciting. Um, yeah, alright, so this is gonna be a piss take. Do I have enough time for this? Yeah, uh, this might be a slightly longer episode, but it's okay, you guys like it. I think. Except for you video skippers out there. Fuck you all. This is shit. I hope you heard that. I hope they didn't skip past that, that'd be very ironic, wouldn't it? <laughs> everyone, call the- call everyone in the comments, call the people who skip videos. Uh, hmm, what should we call them? Just say twats. Just comment twats. Just the word twats. And then those who skip the videos will be like, what? What are they on about? Why are they call why do you say why why are so many people randomly saying twats? And they'll never know. Until they watch the entire video. God, what a conundrum they'll find themselves in. Oh, I bet they won't be able to live that outlive that one. Uh, Alright, anyway. Let's do some murdering. They're attacking me. They do have archers, but I think, uh, honestly, this is going to be a great battle where we just charge straight in. I'll probably actually... You know what? I should have set up a little further back. Let's set up a little further back. We have stand and fight as well, so we want to use that. But we've got to be careful because I do have all the calf. In fact, you know what I might do? Is I'll uh, send you over there. You over there. I'll make the line a little bit longer. And then that way we have some protection for our stand and fight broski. Which is probably going to happen a little bit further forward. Hello? What the fuck's going on here? Alright, you know what? Oh, the fucking... Oh! 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 Anyway, let's charge. Get up in there, boys. We're being shot at and I don't like it. We're being shot, and I don't like it. Taste of your cherry chopstick. Our general is in grave danger, Fuck, my We lord. got very distracted here. Alright, let's just get some charge in there. Oh my god, stop missing the fucking click. Ah! I wanna get my charge bonus! Cavalry! Oh no, it's enemy cavalry. I mean, okay, we are definitely better, but that's quite a, quite a lot of cav. I need to send some stuff over. It's generals as well. No, let's just send these guys over here. You get in there. God, it's the most awkward battle I've ever fought. It's okay, though. Jesus, how are you this slow? Get in there. You guys, go around here. God, I'm glad I can zoom out this far. Uh, cavalry should be absolutely ruining theirs. Again, they they have anti-cav as well on their light cav, but... Ours is more anti-cav than theirs is. Alright, you're just there for protection. Oh, fuck, we've broken through their line already. That's why we have such fantastical units. 
Recovery, do something before the fucking battle's over, eh? Alright, you guys have massacred the calf. Oh, you actually have as well. That was much better than I expected it to go. Uh, there's a general in there. I'd like him dead. My lord! The unit on the left took the most damage. You must have been up against the Yari Sam or something that I didn't notice. Uh, God, I'm so confused. Oh, fuck me, they had reinforcements. <laughs> oh my god, that could have gone bad. Holy shit, that one... Oh, Jesus. Get back on your high horse, brother. Oh my god. I was like... Because this is why I was I was moving the camera. I was like, huh? But I didn't understand. I thought we were... Huh? Because I clicked on a unit, right? I clicked on this one, which means the camera got turned around. And then I saw units over there. I was like, wait, but we were attacking that way. Huh? And that's why I was quiet for like... Three, four seconds, and I was like, fuck, wait, they have reinforcements. That's why that unit's almost dead. Well, that could have gone really poorly. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I just completely forgot. But let's pretend that I didn't, and that was actually part of the plan. I knew they were gonna arrive before it would ever become a problem. Let's just give let's just go with that. Um, I need you guys to do some fucking work. What is this laziness that you're doing here? Yeah, that was um <laughs> That was very risky, holy shit. So they must have been, they must have been fighting up here somewhere. Seeing if I can find some dead horses, but that's just infantry. I don't know. Maybe it was over here. I have no idea. Either way, that was um, kind of crazy. Good battle though. It was very quick, and nice and dirty. This is the kind, this is the perfect kind of battle that you want for an, an army that has no archers. You want you want the enemy to run towards you with inferior troops. It's like, oh yeah, I'll, I'll let you not use your archers, so I'm, I'm fighting, I'm getting to use my, like, full potential of my army, which is built for this kind of thing, against your army, which is not built for it. And it's just kind of, it's great. I mean, look at the, look at the losses on the infantry. Y you can barely even notice anything. We, we lost, we lost 16 in there. I mean, that might be the highest, actually, maybe this one, 24. Pretty sure that's the highest, like, or the biggest white bit of bar I can see there. Obviously the cavalry lost more, but mostly only this one unit and this one. That's one. Our hidden units have been discovered, my lord. I should have been triple speeding this whole time. You know what? Fucking run! You got fucking rapid advance, rapidly advance, my dude. All right, I'm definitely gonna get away with some stuff. You'll never get away with this. Uh, I don't know for how much else we can kill. Decisively victorious, I would say so too. Yeah, that was a nice nice and quick battle. Not a quick and dirty battle this time. I think well, I was a little bit dirty in the fact that I forgot they had reinforcements coming, but we killed them so quickly that it didn't even matter. Like honestly, except for that one unit that took a bit of loss as a cavalry unit, they didn't even get into combat. They routed before they even got there. And in my defense, I did keep two Yari Samurai next to my general. I kept them there in case the enemy cavalry would come around. But that doesn't matter. They were there, so they could have helped. So we were fine. All right. Just uncut, like not unconsciously, subconsciously, my mind was like, "Keep some Yari Samurai back. You'll need them." And I, I didn't need them in the end, but I could have. Didn't quite kill the entire army in there, unfortunately. That would have been nice because then you just take the town instantly. Oh, you want peace, do you? I'm afraid I'm not interested. I do believe I have no interest in that. On. Show me the black ship. Show me making its full circle. Let it go home. Let it go black. Get it? Because it's the black ship. It's not. It's not some racist joke or something. Come on, guys. All right. The ninjas were attacked. Is fair enough. Probably the two standing next to the town, just hanging out. Uh, we built a market, did we? Fair enough. Cool, so that's basically going to be it for now, although I might just take this town. Are you seriously going to try and take this? Are you fuck? What is- huh? I uh, actually wonder if I could take a Waji right now as well and just wipe them out. I think I probably could. So I will. Uh, we could make this into a calf province, but I don't know if that's really necessary. We already have a calf province, and it's unlike. Well, I mean, to be fair, this is more on the front line, so I could make my calf here instead of an ego. But he goes fully developed already with a castle and everything. It'd be a waste not to make use of that. 
So, plus, I mean, all my recruitment stuff is on Kyushu, so it just makes it easier. So let's get rid of these fucking cap buildings, and let's get rid of the Miyoshi once and for goddamn all. Cavalry, do it. Good. I knew I could count on you, cavalry. Perfect. What the fuck? They got a man man trade port here. Oh god, how much? Oh, 41% Christianity, you son of a bitch. At least they didn't seep over. Does it actually. Uh, no, it doesn't, know, it doesn't say it seeps over to other provinces. I thought maybe it didn't because we're not technically bordering, because it's an island. I'm not sure. Either way, we actually are fucked. That's good. Um, it's a little annoying. I have to take my cab out for it, but it's okay. Sanjo, that's messed up. I know, right? That is messed up. Anyway, we'll leave the episode there. So next time we're going to land the army here. Probably just go to war the uh, Matsuda right away. We'll take uh, Iwami as well. And put the Metsuke in there immediately. And make some fat stacks, brother. Um, that's awkward. Uh, yeah, so stuff, it's just, you know, things and stuff and, and things like that are going to happen at some point in the next two couple days. Um, so until then, thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good day and goodbye.